All right, so we're working on a couple things here. I got the slip lead and I got the recall leash. Um, I tried to do some training with the slip lead just now um, in video form for what I wanted to do. He, he kind of started to shut down, so I'm just gonna use this positive interrupter right here. He's obviously looking at the squirrels. Hey, boy, I'm gonna clip this on the front here and I just wanna get him used to moving with me. Come on. Good, out here, taking direction, being used to taking direction and finding that eye contact that I was talking about yesterday. See, you'll see, I'm gonna put this on halfway through. He won't respond as well. Come on. Good boy. Good boy. So see that touch targeting right there? He wasn't doing that with sickly. Good. Good, so moving around, getting him working. Getting him used to a few things. Good, just like this. So see, it's just upping that level. Upping that level of sensitivity of stimuli. Out here this morning, just obsessed with the cat that was walking back and forth right here along the gate. Good. Come on, Teddy. Good. I'm gonna be looking for this touch target right here. And look, you guys can see a bunch of different videos on this with other dogs and try to recreate it. Just to see how different it is from dog to dog to dog. And you can just search recall on my YouTube channel. No. See, he went for this hand. We're not gonna do that. Wait on my training moment to come back. All right, so let's switch it up. Let's let's move to the yard area over here. All right, so we'll set it right here on the ground, much low, uh, 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 uh. much lower angle. There we go. Let's see, I'm going to take a little bit more control over the leash. Come on. Good. He just needs to learn to be cognizant of things. Good. And just walking around and moving with me. I mean, this is how you get through to impulse control. <clears throat> start moving I'm sorry I'm still losing my voice so it's <clears throat> it's kind of hard to, to talk hey 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 okay that may be a first <laughs> Sit. I think I've got me pee on how oh, yeah there's a little pee on the thing so yeah you see this right here just moving just moving Good, and not acting on impulse control. So what I really do recommend to start for him with this is walk him. Walk him before he does this stuff. If you have time, walk him a mile. If you have time, walk him a mile and a half. Uh, so he's been on two walks today and I think he's done pretty well. But you know, with that being said, I think that he um, loves to work um, in these settings. He really has been super, super, uh, fun since we started taking him on the walks. He started to understand that he was going to get exactly what he needs in these scenarios. So let's move right here now. So see, I'm moving around different spots. You know, you're seeing the beginnings of all this. So you're not seeing perfection. You're not seeing a ton, a ton of motivation from him. Good. But I just want him to get to know, like even through the house, 
So look at my hand right here. There he comes, touch. Hey. All right, so let's go to the real test here. It's starting by the gate. So I'm gonna hit the button. I'm, not, I'm honestly not worried about it. Noise. Ah. Come on. So see it's opening. I'm stepping I'm I'm on the leash. So we need to redirect him. Good. Ah, so see almost a redirection. Nope. Come on. So I'm gonna assist. So see how I was working on the, the door this morning when I showed you the uh uh? See that gets them really pumped up. Now I'm doing this in very, very short increments. Let's see, look at that right there. That's a loose leash. You can hear the gate. Back up. Good boy. Ah, ah, ah. Almost. So we're gonna do one more time. So the slip lead really, really helps with this stuff because I can give him a straight up correction like that and have him sit. Ah. So just like yesterday, I told you. You guys are both a lot taller than I am. You know, this is gonna really be beneficial for y'all. Using your legs, using your feet. Good boy. Ah, so see I move, he goes. So we're gonna work on honing that in a little better, but you're seeing the starting process of this. So see right here, come on. Ah, ah, no sir. Back up, come on. He needs this work. He needs this practice, just like this. This is how you get him to stop. So I'm gonna let him investigate. Let him look, look, look. I want to end it on a good note. We're starting to wind things down here. But the main things you don't want to do is you don't want to just repeatedly call him. Okay, that's gonna be the thing because we want him to be. Now let's go ahead and remove this. I'll show you the slip lead really quickly. Yeah, we'll see All right, so I'm gonna show you this. You walked on this today and it, it went really well. Come on. I'm gonna show you some stuff with his collar so he doesn't slip out of it and stuff like that too. Just getting him to move. With it. Come on. Good, just get him to move. Move around, come on. Working. Just working. I'm gonna take it off. He actually worked a lot better just then than he did before. So then now, see right here, he's got full reign, he's got full freedom. Come on. Hey, touch. So then I'm gonna go stand, ah, ah, ah. Back up. So then that's how I start to take ownership over the spaces. Good boy, sit. Sit. Nice. And we're gonna end it on that note right there. Oh. So see, what I want him to do is not to obsess over that. Come on. But with this right here, see how he does that? Come on. So then what I do is I get loose, I hold it loose. Good, and I work them on that. So I'm not doing that to him. But I'll show you some more in like a little video. So, all right, so we're getting things going. We're getting to know each other. It's been about 24 hours. It's a little past noon. So uh, I'm proud of him. I don't feel like he's gonna run away from me because I feel like I, we got some things figured out, but um, <clears throat> it's time for me to have some tea. It's time for him to take a little break and uh, we'll talk soon, bye-bye.